Welcome folks to our look at Grave Days. This is the early alpha version of a zombie game that's a bit like Project Zomboid and a couple of other things thrown in as well. Um, already there's actually a zombie outside. There's also pissing down this time. It's roguelike, uh, all procedurally generated so everything's always different. And there's plenty of crafting to be done and stuff like that. Already we should be checking our chests. We've got quite a few things including bullets. Also a hammer to replace the crappy hammer that you start with. Nice. I'll take it. There's a crow outside. Don't know what his game is. See a lot of crows around in this game. They've survived. Well done, crows. Nothing in the bog. So let's see. My current objectives. Well, it says survive three days on the right, but there are other ones as well. Like, for instance, build a chemistry table, which is fairly straightforward. You just need quite a bit of wood. Really, what I need is an axe, so I can start some um, getting extra wood. But let's arm ourselves, just because we will actually have to go outside fairly soon. Can I go in the fridge? Yes, I can. I can get oh beans, delicious, delicious beans. Bloody runner beans. God damn it! Looks like we've already exhausted this place. So let's pop outside. Turn my flashlight off. Oh, Sandy Pod. This is actually very sandy in Sandy Pod. Oh, uh, is that a dog? Maybe the dogs have survived as well. Maybe they're bad dogs. Maybe they're zombie dogs. Let's have a bit of an explore. It wasn't raining in my last game. I think that must be a random event. There's also a wheat. Thankfully there aren't that many zombies are Oh! Okay. So that's my zombie awareness thing. Those little white things, those little white bars that appear around me. Show me the direction and the awareness of nearby zombies. See, we get closer. Oh no, he's not quite seen me, so he's okay. I feel like if I carry on going down this road... Oh! I thought I was going to find some dogs. No, I've actually found them. Like a beach of some description. Oh, careful. Zombie over there having a bit of a dip. I can still hear dogs in there. Maybe it's just an ambient sound that plays. Because I'm, I feel like I'm leading myself towards the dogs. Because they, they, they keep on barking in my left ear. Uh, let's, let's go off the beaten track. Let's not go off the beaten track. <laughs> God damn it. This road just keeps on going on. I'm leaving my um, um, base behind, but to be honest, there's nothing really much in my base for me to worry about too much. Oh dear. Now where are we going? Now there's a sound in my left ear, which is very bizarre. It's not even slightly dog. It's just chaos. Yeah, that seemed to be on the, um, <laughs> on the road to nowhere here. Oh my god! <laughs> there's a lot of zombies there. Oh, he looks like the mere of them. I need to make sure... If you shoot your gun, you are going to make quite a bit of din. I think I might... Um, let's go into that, that menu. I might get my hammer out instead. You can punch with space. Or you can use your left click to use whatever weapon you've got equipped. I could do with finding more houses now. Because I'm not really finding much stuff to loot. There's lots of roads around here, so that does suggest that there might be some buildings. Oh, here we go. Now, what have we found? Oh, just a regular house. That's probably for the best, and there doesn't seem to be anyone inside here. Ah, another chesty poos. You can look at the map bigger there. Ooh, what have we got? We've got quite a bit. Oh, we've got an axe! Yes, excellent. Soil? Sulphur, wheat. Bruce fucking Lee increases punching knockback. Well, double click that and probably learnt it. Pot, such potty language. Oh, I'm thinking beans. I am very much thinking of beans. There are a couple of radial wheels here, by the way. I keep on pressing the wrong one. I and mean, if you press Q, you bring up the, like, a, this is your instant inventory for if you want to, like, chow down on an apple or whatever. And the other one over here, the other radio menu, um, gets a, a different way of accessing inventory, or your map, or your objectives. Or you can actually build a bunch of stuff. Requirements are in the bottom right, so it needs things like wooden planks and hammer. Oh, we've actually got a hammer, haven't we? Oh, we can actually build a door if we really wanted to. We could build a oh, we could build a workbench, a chems and med workbench. That's actually what we need to do, isn't it? That's actually an objective. There we go. See what we can actually make. So we can. I don't think we can actually make anything here. Everything's red. Oh, we can make empty capsules. Oh, we can make empty capsules out of wheat. I well, might as well do that. Wood scraps. Wood scraps. 
Unfortunately, these empty capsules now... I need eight of these if I'm going to make suppressants. And they also need a bunch of other stuff as well. We've got a bit of sulfur. Not got anything else, though. I'm still a bit hungry. Um, that's, the, that's another radial menu entirely. Got so many of the damn things. Oh! Those beans... Not really... Oh, that's more like it. A birdie burger. Right, here we go. Nothing in the fridge. I mean, I could build a door here if I really wanted to. I think we're good. Oh, we'll do. I'll get the axe out. And I'll do a bit of the old chopperoo. Which does get me a little bit of crafting material. There we go. That'll be scraps. Oh, maybe we burst open the bog. Critically damage the bog. That's given us... Oh, just literally some wooden scraps. It was a wooden bog. Yeah. Right, let's get out. Frying pan! Let's do some gold. Vic and Bob tonking. Hey, what's this? Oh, it's just, a, it's just a rock. It's just some decoration. So here's a, there's a day-night cycle. Um, we're currently, by the looks of it, coming, up, coming into daytime soon. Which will... Um, I think that'll help matters. Now, here's a house. This is We haven't discovered this one before. Oh, it's the grocery store. Sometimes you're starting. Uh oh. Oh. There's quite a few lads. Maybe I'll get my axe back out. I don't really want to use my gun because that will attract zombies when you fire it. Right. Tonk it! That was a critical hit as well. Nice. No, that wasn't a chemistry table I built then. Oh, wait, what's you? <laughs> there was actually a zombie there. I thought I should build a chemistry table and got the got the objective, but it's not telling me I've got that. Hmm, whatever. Let's go back to the kill 50 zombies one. Take all that, including some much needed food probably. Well, actually, don't really need it that much, but I'll be eating them. Because otherwise they'll clog up my inventory. You don't get a huge inventory. Right, shush, shush, go! Careful. Did not see me. Can do some good hits with this. God, there's so many zombies. Oh! Alerted them. Somehow. Right, thankfully their pathfinding ain't great in this early stage. Careful. Their awareness isn't brilliant either sometimes. Right, there's still at least one who knows exactly where I am. I think it's this one over here. Oh. And there's another one there. They give up quite easily at the moment. So as long as you've got a good weapon, you should be okay. You can also tonk all the shelves. Right. I've killed quite a lot of zombies in here. Um, I've killed 11 out of the 50. That's in my objectives. So we may as well be um, having a good old hit. We're not actually taking much damage at all so far. In fact, he's thinking bandage, but I think I'm okay. Oh, that wasn't very good. That took three hits that time. Hehehehe. <laughs> He's thinking, why is he thinking bandage? I don't think I need it. Now let's go into my actual inventory. No, it's not letting me use it, so it's fine. I mean, the red bar is my health, so that's that's at top. Now, can I actually get through these windows? I don't think I can. I think I'm safe. There's actually a zombie right here. It's not like Project Zomboid, where you can go through anywhere you want. There we go. 18 killed. Get out of here. Oh, no, we don't need to go in there. I could do some more wood tonking, but... Oh, hello. There we go. I think it's one of those games where uh, the zombies are s easy to fight on their own. But as soon as there's a horde, as soon as you make too many mistakes like that, you are going to be doomed. My health comes back. That's, I think my, I am losing health, but it does come back quite easily, which is merciful. Did I actually not go in there? Oh, there's a whole room in there which I didn't go in. Holy shit. It's crammed full of goodness. Well, boxes. Yeah, it's just boxes. So that'd be good raw materials if I wanted wooden scraps, but otherwise, whatever. There's a lad in there, but I can't get to him. Well, let's continue our exploration. First of all, Hang on. 
get some food. We all need to find more food, so I will need to find probably more regular houses where I can get some. Can I get... No, that tree doesn't actually exist. Well, can I get the wheats then? Am I getting wheat here? 28 wheats. 30 wheats? Hmm. Oh, cotton. Take that. Get my savage lands on. I should be able to make more bandages at some point. My axe is actually slowly but surely running out here. I think I might change to frying pan. Because I want my axe so I can damage crates and things. That's actually a huge warehouse full of stuff. More cotton. Okay, I can just gather that normally. Don't need the axe for that. More cotton. Now, which one of these is an actual door? Oh, there it is. There's a door. Oh, let's let's test out the frying pan. That took three hits. Not great. Oh, it is actually good the warehouse as well. That's what it's called. This is great. Not great. The frying pan is piss. But I refuse to use my gun, which will just alert everything ever. A little more than halfway now. 27 out of 50. Good God. Ah, oh, some chests in the bottom left. That's what we need. I think... Mm, let's quickly grab this. Oh, shit, loads of stuff. Including a burger. Nice. Let's eat that. Take all. I took all off from that, didn't I? Yes. Excellent. We are up to full strength, pretty much. Hmm. Axe. <laughs> Sod it. It's so much easier with the axe. The game really doesn't like me actually um, hitting boxes. The zombies don't, anyway. Oh, there's another door there. Oh, it's into a ooh, a new place. Oh, there's a little workbench as well. Oh, careful. Oh, 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 oh. Lads. I'm safe. I'm fine. All good. Plus another chesty poos. Ooh. Oh, I can't get it. What is it? Breatharian guide lets lets you go longer without getting hungry, so I'll just double click that to learn it. So I am I'm slowly but surely leveling up. Plus I got this. What's this? Cure. Cures you from zombie infection and stops fevers. Oh, I'm gonna get I'm getting the good stuff. Cooked chicken. Okay, it's not chicken. Uh oh. It's <laughs> a bit worrying. Maybe if I craft some bandages. And I can use up all the cotton. I might have to do that at the work at the, the chemistry bench though. Oh, hello. I might as well get rid of you. There we go. And yet another chest. Doing well here. Including another gun. Well, I don't really need another gun. I'll be fine. Get got. So there's the door. However, I found an, a chemistry lab. Which is good because I can turn that cotton into bandages. Six cotton. Craft. Now, how do I get rid of... There we go. So that means I have given myself a little bit of space for other stuff. Don't really think I need to make more bandages anytime soon. 39 zombies killed out of 50. I do feel like I should achieve that objective. But I actually also have to survive three days to, to um, achieve another one. I'm not quite sure if that will actually unlock more objectives or whether, or, the, or whether the game's in too early a stage to really have anything else, but you, you can craft all sorts of things. If only you can find certain things. You can get gunpowder. Oh god, I've just re replaced all the cotton that I just got rid of. Yeah, whatever. See what else is out here. I do wonder if, you, if there are certain things you can actually... Oh my god, hang on. Careful. All good. There's another crow. Right, there's more stuff over here by the looks of it. Because there's a path. Let's check over here. Do, 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 do. Oh! No. I feel like if I follow paths, so I should actually get to some houses eventually, but... I don't know how the procedural generation works. Leaving Sandy Pond. But where am I actually going here? Kalekirk! Very Scottish sounding. Hey, look! I found a hospital. That must be full of supplies. Currently at the east wing, by the looks of it. Oh my god, yeah, it's quite big. 
It's a big old hospital. Can I get in there? No, I can't. That's not a door. There's the door. This should hopefully have enough zombies in it to get us up to 50. Yeah, there's a lot of lads around. Oh, bloody hell! Shitty death. Okay, now there's a lot of them. The music's getting very dramatic. Oh. Not quite as many as I actually expected. But I like the way the music dynamically changes. It's, it's nice. To oh, shit! Actually, I'm bleeding. Look, my um, my thing is going down. Oh, my God, I'm, I'm leaving blood everywhere. Hang on. There we go. That stemmed the tide of <laughs> that rather surprisingly bad injury. Water! Didn't realize you needed water. Ingredient Z! Ah, that's, um, that's an ingredient in the suppressant. Is there anything I don't need now? I've got two hammers. I don't really need two, two hammers. I'm going to take that. Uh, anything else I've got uh, duplicates of? I don't really need all that wheat, I don't think. Oh, hang on. Get back in. Get in! There we go. There. See what else is in here. 47 zombies. Nearly there. Nearly at our little targety poos. Um, that box is so in the way. What a bastard of a box. More stuff. Including rubber tubing. Really am now running out of space. I don't think I can get rid of anything. Those empty capsules. Bollocks to him. No one in here. Actually reasonably safe. Actually, I'm not 100% sure what that H is on the minimap. Maybe I'll have a bit of a check. I think that's just market. Oh, no. That's a dead zombie. Um. Don't know. Ooh. That's more stuff. Including pipe. For whacking. Um. Cotton. Sod the wheat. Anything in here? Chest? God, I'm getting so much stuff. What's in here? The fact that it was locked was a bit interesting. Nice. Oh, a hat. Yes. Take the rest. Oh, I'm doing well now. I'm stocking up like buggery. Oh, I do need some food. You have to open this every time. God damn it. <laughs> Beans! I'm going to be farting all night now. Oh, piss. I ran out of beans and then ate something random. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, that's a weird little... Like a little garden. Wheelchair. Box. Crate. Not many zombies. I'm actually genuinely surprised just how few zombies are actually in this place. Sneakers! For sneaking. Although this is actually a... Something to go make me go faster. Ah! Okay, this will this should um get us going. In fact, let's. Oh shit! <laughs> let's just kill them all. Kill. Objective complete. Yes. That was the the one room full of zombies. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Die, you little bastards. Oh. The, 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 was that some sulphur? Not quite sure where I think the zombie might have dropped it. Well, I think we sorted that lot out. Out of the hospital. And let's just tonk you! There we go. Anything to eat? Let's eat that weird chicken stuff. There we go. Nice. Whoa! Found another warehouse. So it's got something else that's marked on the map as well, which I'm not 100% sure what it means. Oh, oops, oops. Oh dear. Oh, oh shit! Flashlight. <laughs> so I can see what's going on. Qu quick, axe. Oh, shitty death. Oh my god, there's a million of them. Retreat, retreat. Use my running shoes. I can't. I'm going to have to tonk them. Tonk? No! Well, that escalated quickly. Two survivor point, points earned. We didn't quite get to three days, did I? 
Finalize survivor death and claim points. Two. <laughs> Fine. Well, this is a free to download now, so check it out if you want to have a bit of the old zombie exploration, Project Zomboid type fun. Um, cool, thanks for watching. Do subscribe to the channel to be notified when new stuff goes live. Check out the rest of my Alpha Soup videos to for more games of early in development. Uh, and click the link to my Patreon if you want to support the channel and keep us in new indie games and new equipment and all that. Uh, see you next time. Bye for now.